Meathead. <laughs> oh, Arch, I killed my back. Oh, oh, damn Republicans. Shirley Jensen wrote the company manual on slips and falls. And on the last hurried day of his life, a pedophile Dan falls. Kraft knew the crucial importance of safety when Quick, take his organs. Electrical equipment. <laughs> but everything changed on that final day. Looks like a Not fat Dan Aykroyd. Experience or skill, but because of some ways they thought and felt. As one accident report said later, it was almost as if all three had been sabotaged by their own brains. Ah! Oh! Sabotage. On 2020. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -bum. The end. To the scientists oh. studying the In fairy wary land. Spaghetti! Complicated three pound gray and white organ within your skull. The wrinkled, jelly like mass yeah. you call. Your brain's all wrinkled and jelly like. I am, on all accounts, your most prized possession. It's Swedish and by food. Far your most complicated. For here, within my 12 billion cells, yeah, you're infected. For all your thought, behavior, memory, knowledge, emotions, and attitudes. The most basic and vital of which provide you. This is your brain on Fox. <laughs> Any questions? Dangerous machinery. I show you how to use it safely. He just beats a rod all day. Doesn't know why, but. I tell you how to handle them. Flying I make sparks. I help you know how to protect yourself. Objects. I pee in a jug. I program you to lift and carry them safely. Dangerous surfaces. I'm the, I'm the brawny man. To avoid slips and falls. Hazardous conditions. I alert you to the dangers and program you to react oh. with care. Within and throughout the whole range of hazardous situations. All right, now bring out the coke. provide you with intelligent response. Morgan Freeman. Forced by your basic. Hey, call my mom while I'm up here. <laughs> and your unique ability to imagine the possible consequences of unsafe. Don't ever tell I'm Superman. Oh. And yeah. so I provide you with the wisdom to perceive danger. And the knowledge and skill to perform tasks safely. I also give you the xylophone music. It is not enough to know. We've been taught the right way to lift things. I mean, I knew better than to lift up that sack the way I did. But my mustache said otherwise. I knew it wasn't smart to run. Boy, you knew when you were then. <laughs> so why did Shirley Jensen fracture her hip? I was in a hurry to get the job done. You see it. It was Friday, and I, I wanted to get away early. And my mustache said and otherwise. Why did Pete O'Connor <laughs> rupture a lumbar disc? Working at the carnival, I'm guessing. Way. I thought I could get away with it. It was easy. In a hurry. Listen to some reasons so often reported for injury. I just didn't think it would happen <sighs> to me. <sighs> I was in a hurry that day, and I guess I was just careless. I'd always done it that way before and never got hurt. Or no, it's Steve Buscemi, I think. I just wasn't watching what I was doing, I guess. I just thought taking a shortcut would be easier. That's I'd all. Fallen I'd fallen and I just didn't want to get up. Shortcuts. The easy way. It happens all the time. But the easy way is too often the Hey, I'm cutting way. over and here. Shortcuts can make deep and painful cuts if they happen around. It's Harold Ramis. And the payoff ah, seen in the raspberry. Only the one man would dare give me the raspberry. Fact of the Isn't that is the guitarist the from Journey? On or off the job happen to people who know how to work safely. So why Brian so May. People kill and injure themselves every mm. year. Well, let me tell you just a bit more about myself. Pills. As so many know. I am extremely sensitive to the chemical influences from all kinds of drugs. And just one drop of alcohol in a thousand drops of blood is quite enough to blur and distort what I think. Good clean booze. The brain. That's all you can think about. Doesn't he have to go sing YMCA? Yep. can also distort the way you think here and see. Indifferent, impatient, be Arthur, bored, sleepy, 
stressed, upset, hungover, and mustache. Perhaps coupled with attitudes like, it won't happen to me, it's not my problem, shortcuts save time, this job is dull. It's the other the guy's fault. For me. And serenity now. Why would you carve your brain open? In combination, Peace of mind. Through my cortical layers like a sharp knife, releasing the risk-taking attitudes which bounce between my billions of cells with the familiar words you know so well. Who needs a ladder? A chair's good enough. Let it <laughs> ring. It's not Steve Winwood doesn't approve hey, of ladders. It's not my problem if the floor is slippery. Picking stuff up off the floor isn't part of my job description. You're a librarian. <laughs> or, in the case of Dan Kraft. <laughs> See you tomorrow, Jerry. See you later, Dan. Hey, Dan, hold it up a minute, will you please? Yeah, Al, what's up? Oh, uh, the circuit to the machine shop is shorting out or something. The breaker's overheating, and I want you to take care of it for me. Come on, Al, I was just ready to take off. You said I could to leave To the Great today, White remember? North. Yeah, but you have to check the circuit first. Can't afford to have something blow and shut the shop down. Can't you have Jim or Charlie do it? I really got to get out of here. I'm sorry, Dan. You're the only guy. Hey, he's got oh, baked beans for it cheese. Take long. Yeah, I know. Nothing should take long, but everything does, huh? This is going to be the fastest check job you ever saw. <laughs> Count down to tragedy, and the clock is ticking. You see, I like where this the is vast going. Majority of injury accidents are created by people, not things. Tripping hazards don't reach up and grab your feet. Machines don't reach out and grab your mutton chops. Hand tools don't slice and jab your flesh by themselves. File drawers don't lie and wait to hurt you without help. Stairways don't snatch their steps out from under you. <laughs> he looks like and a news reporter. Objects don't conspire to strain your back. No, hey. while it grieves me to say it. Accidents originate it's those right tight here 70s among pants. my 12 billion cells, made easy by the attitudes which color the way so many think and feel. It this brain could be yours for $13.99. This way. It's hurry, not hurry, problem. hurry! I haven't had an Big saving. QVC is selling new brains. Unfortunately, it is one of my tendencies to just. Doesn't she one of Charlie's angels? Dangerous attitudes and attitudes. No, she was one of Hervé's angels. You get oh. away with them. Though, like good Russian safe Berlin, guns, the chances for catastrophic consequences increase with the frequency of play. Russian roulette. Play it at work. And we need a new cameraman. Who will be injured today? Are the very same people who got away with it yesterday. It's the wrong knee, you dope. So, what's to do? <laughs> it's her first day yeah, as a stunt woman. Starters, consider the consequences of shortcuts and dangerous behavior. Risk of snatching up a heavy load well, like that. Oh, crapped them. Or that. A uh, unibomber. Right, the consequences could involve a ruptured disc and some mighty serious surgery. And anal Yet probing. Back injuries from improper lifting and carrying still account for more time lost than any other on or off job call. Could you get a more blind doctor? See what happened to me was all those mail sacks looked pretty much alike. And I kind of got in the habit of grabbing them off a of dolly and tossing them in the truck. There's Meathead getting rid of all the hate mail to Archie. Now I know that's not the right way to do it. But Screw this, I'm going to become a director. <laughs> well, this one day I grabbed a really heavy Then people sack. will listen to me. Oh! And I've been laid up ever since. I never should have picked up Sally Struthers. Risk of running downstairs like that? Absolutely, you could... Oh, wait till Rod Burgundy hears board. about this. <laughs> and the consequences could be and have That's been some action news right there. <laughs> to a broken neck. Still... Slips and falls hospitalize hundreds of thousands of people a year. Who Yoko just Ono could be your nurse. Consider the consequences. She'll sing to you, too. One Friday, oh, that's a Julia, man. Julia Child is going Oh, that's a man, man. <laughs> My boss said she had to have a report that was in an office downstairs. The elevators in our building are really slow, so I took the stairs. Well, like oh. I said, I was in a hurry. So <coughs> I Stairs are bad. I sure took a nasty fall. Yee! But well, stairs were a new theme at the time. Consider the consequences. Me again. Because, you see, it's one of my characteristics that while I may receive inputs from your ears, nose, eyes, and other sense organs, I don't always allow you to recognize the possible risks they perceive. You see, I'm kind of a dick. 
So while you may see the slippery floor, the open drawer, maybe you shouldn't the urinate lines, on the floor. The overloaded circuit, the cluttered ground, the forgotten tool, the unused seatbelt. Now let's bring in a so bunch of toddlers. Often <laughs> fail to signal danger, and the result can be as dangerous as a lighted match in a gas tank. A pinto. Huh? So use your brain. No. Be alert. You use yours. Force me not just to see, but to make you act. So make it corduroy. Clean. Pick it up. Close it. Clean it. Pull it. Push it. Tow it. It's a golf mill Ford. Or make it to the bathroom. Finally, remember, things change. Just because you used your office chair as a ladder last week and got away with it, this time it may roll out from under you. It could have a mind of its own. Just because you lifted things like that a hundred times before and got away with it, you may not this time. And just because you didn't need your seatbelt yesterday, it may save your life today. For a hamburger today. I'll be your safety belt. And last of all, Remember, people change. By the year, day, hour, and minute as they run through the spectrum of feelings, emotions, and attitudes, some of which may be hazardous to you. <laughs> Careful. Anxious about home problems? Careful. Bored Ugh. with doing the same old thing? Stephen King. Careful. Mad at the boss? I'm Richard Dreyfus. <laughs> Upset and in a hurry like Dan Kraft. I'm gonna shove this screwdriver right in here. Mike, Mike, do you have any safety locks with you? I forgot mine. I need to lock off this circuit breaker while I work on the switch to the machine shop by the loading dock. Yeah, I just use me, some uh, bubble you gum. In the storeroom, though. No, I don't have time. You gonna be here for a while? No, I'm through now. Ah, oh, great. Well, <laughs> I'll even know it, I guess. I'm only gonna be working there a few minutes. That's good. Uh, you're going to be cutting the power off to the machine shop, and you know how those guys are. I'm in just as much a hurry as they are. They're not even in the same yeah, building. They're just speaking through their mustaches. And so Dan Craft, an experienced and skillful worker, takes the shortcut he thought would save him five minutes and will cost him his life. And so I'm concerned. Because while people use my highest capabilities and best functions to collect safety... Yep, touch the fuse panel with both hands. They so often That's how any electrician does it. ...overrule and replace them with their simplest and most self-destructive emotions. Why don't you test it like a nine bolt and stick your tongue on it? And the tragic result is that I become the cause of accidents, not their cure. Remember, I said things change. Remember? Well, you remember? In the case of Dan Kraft, a passing forklift blew away his note. And 90 seconds later, someone... A knife went through his brain. <laughs> ...seeing the open and unlocked circuit breaker, decided to close it. <laughs> I got gas. Portrait of an accident that should never have happened. And he was found dead with a bare upper lip. <laughs> blew his mustache across the shop the 30 feet. The majority of you who do consider the consequences of unsafe behavior by lifting correctly, using stairs properly. Ah, yeah, that's right. You have to walk down them. performing thousands of other tasks both on and, and off the job. For you, safety attitudes are the keystone to accident prevention. I'm still because making you know sparks. So well. That no job is so important and no Oh god, it's so Illinois important. Bell. They're never gonna that get it fixed. And thought cannot be taken to perform the job safely. As the source of all your wisdom, I ought to know. Didn't someone cut you in half a while ago? Yeah, what does he know? Back with Tinky Winky Land. Well, I feel more relaxed now. De Groot. I am De Groot. <laughs> Kirkpatrick, he'll punch you in the stomach. Thank you, neighbor. Let's go to picture picture. 
Oh, see, it's from California. That makes more sense. Ah. You know, a cargo light gives off a romantic glow. Never have to wait in my popcorn stand because there's something women like to buy to pick up, man. You can set my truck on fire and roll it down a hill and I still wouldn't trade it for a coupe de ville. And an eight-foot bed that never has to be made. You know, if it weren't for trucks, we wouldn't have tailgates. I met all my wives. In traffic jams, is just something women like about a pickup man. A bucket of rust or a brand new machine. Once you're on the block and you'll know what I mean. You can set my truck on fire and roll it down a hill and I still wouldn't trade it for a coup to bill. I got an eight foot bed that never had.